This is the uh, hydroponic kit, uh, or this is the way you receive it out of the box. Now, um, as I said, I'm going to glue all my fittings. Uh, they recommend using Teflon tape, um, but I've never done that ever before, so I'm actually going to use uh, some PV uh, PVC um, pipe glue. <laughs> It's all in pieces and it still is. It's only just uh, sitting there ever so carefully. I wanted to just square everything up. So if you come this way, and if you look down here, what I did with the Sharpie pen, I just lined all the holes, just uh, so they were all basically vertical. And I just put a little mark on the pipe and a little mark on the uh, the fitting, so when you put them together and glue them, um, that you, you know that you'll be on the right, uh, it'll be vertical for you. So we're gonna pull it apart now, so it'll be probably gonna collapse, because I just put it together ever, ever so carefully. hydroponic kit uh, or this is the way you receive it out of the box now um, as I said I'm going to glue all my fittings uh, they recommend using Teflon tape um, but I've never done that ever before so I'm actually going to use uh, some PV, uh, PVC um, pipe glue so now you see where my mark is here where I had it before and this is the uh, center line so what we're going to do is just uh, put a bit of tape Glue. some glue around the fitting it's sort of a nice uh, a nice amount and sometimes you should probably sand uh, the uh, surface. pipe the surface to make help make it stick together but because this is uh, not under pressure or anything like that this should be more than enough and then also put a little bit inside your uh, fitting on this side up oh, not down there and now get your two marks and line your marks up because once you push it in and get it there if you go get the marks see the marks are lined up so uh, uh, it should be now when it's up it should be pretty well vertical okay it's right do the same for the, the next one that's a clever type a little bit of glue going around Gotta keep it clean. Okay, same thing again. Line it up, push them in, and just check it a little bit. Yep. And now we do the third one. What's that? This is a, a PV, uh, PVA, I think they call it, P or PVC. It's a uh, plumber's glue for uh, um, pipes. Yeah, plastic pipes. Stand it up. And 
make sure it's sitting the right way. Again, some glue on the inside. So we've got to work pretty quick here. So we've got to seal them all. This is what they give you, um, and uh, it's just uh, thread tape, uh, Teflon thread tape. And uh, they expect you to wrap it around the pipe, I gather, like this. And um, uh, and then use this as a seal. So I'm gonna, I've never done this before, so bear with me. Normally I've only used it for thread tape. So actually it's a little bit different. It's not so much like, this is a different type of tape. It's a little bit more fiber in it, so oh. So I'm going to assume you just put one layer on it. Let's see. And you screw it in. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's amazing. Um, yeah, so you can actually use this. It's not actually a Teflon tape. It's a, a slightly different. Um, it's got more body to it than Teflon um, and yeah, so that's that's the first leg. So we'll do the second leg Oh, that's the rear leg And with it when you put it on uh, obviously you've got to go the, the depth of the The socket So you need about about 20 mil a couple of layers and then I'm working my way back bring it off just remember the way you wound it see if I unwind it there like that so you, you want to twist that way anti-clockwise when you push it in because that'll w keep the tape tight so I'll turn it over okay so there's the tape. So if I wind it in anti-clockwise, it'll just stay tight. If I go clockwise, it will unscrew the tape. Twist it all the way in and push. Beautiful. I'm impressed with that. As I said, I've never used the tape part before. And again, what I'm gonna do on the bottom, short legs, One's longer than the other. Okay, right. So, yes. Sorry, two legs, one longer than the other. So, obviously, you've got the fitting down here for your pump. So that, that has to have the short leg, and uh, the longer leg is on the other side. So, uh, again, same thing. I'm going to glue it because I'm not going to. You won't need to take these off. So, putting putting the um, glue on. push it in, twist it, and there you go, home. Same thing on the bottom. And twist and push. Oh boy. There we go. We should now be able to sand it up. Again? Uh, the little pump that will pump the uh, uh, solution around the uh, around around the system. Around the system.
Okay, so with the pump, uh, you know, if, if you uh, stand it up, it's going to kick. So that's not very good because it, it obviously, uh, uh, unless we could pull the hose up further and we can stand it up. Let me check up here. So if we go up here, the hose is up here. I may not be able to grab it now. Going to do, I'm going to lay, just stick the pump to the side here. Um, and it's, see, it's a nice straight curve. So we'll just do it like that. And uh, always keep your lid on, keep your, when you, when you have it. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna connect this. We're just gonna run water through it um, and uh, just rinse everything out. So uh, I'll go get myself ready for water. Right here, this is actually rainwater that we catched last night. What is that? I got my power. Um, it comes with this adapter because it's uh, a Malaysian plug, obviously, and uh, and then then you've got an uh, international um, adapter on the other side. It takes about three or four different countries. So uh, that's the unit there. It's ready to go. So I'm going to just put some water in the system and. Um, Cover the pump fully, so I'm going to bring it up, keep it about 10 mil from the top. Might need some more once this, uh, it's running. So push it back around, move it, put the lid on. Okay, now we're going to plug this in, turn it on, and hopefully it'll start pumping water. Yes, is, uh, it's pumping. You look up the top here, here, here's the water. So what it's going to do now, it's going to fill everything up and then it will start circulating. You hear it trickling away. Thank you everyone for watching, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and leave a comment. Thank you!